Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to go over what's in my mailbox. So I didn't do a video yesterday, but I also didn't open what I got yesterday. So I got um, this, this, and something else, this, yesterday. But I didn't open them yesterday. Um, so I wanted to include them with today's. So one of these is an AliExpress order, which is this one. And I can actually open that one first um, so I can go ahead and get through that quickly. And um, I can try to figure out the rest of this stuff. Okay. Ha ha ha. Oh, and y'all are going to have to let me know um, how my light is because I recently got a couple more lights to try to make the quality of the video a little bit better. So um, definitely give me some feedback on that and let me know if it's better or if you even notice a difference because you may not even notice a difference. Anyway, I'm super excited because I know what this is. Okay, so uh, that's it for that. Um, I did open the window. So I could give you some of the prices um, if I can figure out which one's which. Okay, so this is um, a natural collection. You can see the stickers on the back here, actually. Um, they're gold and black, like you can see. If I can get it open. Ooh, that's cool. That's, it's like, it's thick. It feels like really thick rice paper is what it feels like. That's pretty. And there's stickers. Isn't that pretty? So this one was, I don't know because I can't see it. Um. Okay, so I don't see this one. I thought I was going to tell you the prices, but I think my computer's got other plans. All right, so there's that. Um, this one. This one, I see. This one was $2.78. And it's all free shipping. So, and that's really cool. Ah, ah, I'm dropping stuff. I like this paper, too. And, again, you can see the stuff that's on the back right there so we've got some and these are all like that thick rice paper feel as well oh look at that isn't that pretty the fairy so there's that um looks like you get three of each design some butterflies um a spoon a heart um Oh, a boot. Isn't that pretty? So there's that. Um, maybe I should stand up. I think it might be better for you guys if I stand up. Let's put this back in there. Get in there. Okay. So there's that. And then this one is a stamp um, and this one's really cool because there's a dragon right there you see the dragon that's really cool um, old fisherman best quality sea product and I actually got this one because of this this text stamp here um, this was I don't know if I'm looking at the right thing. Hmm. No, I don't think that's the right thing. I thought it was. Nothing I buy really is going to be over like a couple dollars. Um, there are a few exceptions for that, depending on what it is. Um. And this is not coming out. There we go. Look at that paper. Isn't that pretty? And then that's what's inside. There. 
And these all have gold um, accents to them. And see, I like stuff like this. Judgment. It's like little miniature tarot cards. Just kind of pretty. Like I, I, I don't know if you guys have ever seen tarot cards, but the artwork on them is insane. Some of them are just so elegant and just so pretty. So, oh, this one's stuck to that one. Alright, so then we got this one. Right. I don't know if y'all want me to open all these or not. This one's kind of, the package is a little busted. So there's that. Isn't that pretty? I love that. That's really pretty. Some birds. Some flowers. Um, it's like hands. This is really pretty. And there's several to each design. Um, like there's, I think, three of each. I'm just grabbing the stack of each design to show you guys. Birds. It's pretty. Some arrows. Some butterflies. Some more flowers. Oh, that's pretty. I like that. That's neat. Okay. So there's that. I'm just going to set this aside because that package is... Um, coming apart a little bit, so I'm going to transfer it into something different. Oh, and I just broke this one too. I love this paper that they've packaged with. It's really pretty. So this is just some foliage. I love mushrooms. If you guys haven't figured that out, I love mushrooms. Mushrooms and flowers. Anything that really can be related to like the fantasy world. Um, fairies, dragons, gnomes, flowers, mushrooms, pixies, and all kinds of stuff. So this is just a flower group. What? Stay. All right. So I'm going to set that one aside as well. And then this one is a smaller collection. Um, it says mellow and taste. Uh, basically, they're just like kitchen stuff. Like there's a kettle right there, a blender, a jar of spices, um, um, a pitcher and a spoon. That's everything that's in there. And then the same concept, but of garden-esque stuff. So there's that. And that's actually everything from here. So I'm going to actually move this and then I'll pop a squat and sit back down. Oy, oy. Ah, and hopefully not get my cords all wrapped up in a way. Okay, so these couple packages, they actually arrived at the same time. But they're from the same person. They're from Miss Jill. So um, we do a lot of squats back and forth. If you haven't figured that out yet. Um, so one of these is yay. <laughs> uh, fabrics and trims. So um, in one of the emails I sent her, I asked her if she wanted fabrics and trims. But uh, being a big goofball, I had already sealed up the envelope that I was sending her package through whatever. So I just said, you want to do another, you know, swap of 
of six by nine, whatever. And oh my gosh, she sent me more teacups. You are amazing. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Um, so I love these teacups. I do not have this die, at least not to my knowledge. And um, yeah, that's amazing. So she, um, she cut them out for me and sent them. This is extra. This was not part of the swap. This was just because she's a sweetheart and that is amazing. Thank you so much. And then here's some fabrics. Um, some of these, if I'm not mistaken, yes, some of them are wired and it looks like some of them are not. So here's some red and this blue. I actually really like this blue. And she sent me a ton. Oh my gosh. I sent her like a little bit of a lot and she sent me a lot of a lot. <laughs> I feel bad. Uh, um, but I like this because I can add this to, um, to my little, my thingies. Okay. I'm going to put this back in the bag before I make it come all undone and such. And then I'll be upset because then it'll just be everywhere. And oh my God, stop. Okay. Go back in there. Go back in the hole. Okay. All right. I did it. Sort of. Okay. And this is why I do things off camera because I am not very elegant with it. I'm just like very rough and tough. And, okay. I love these. These are cool. Um, oh, this is cool. This is a bunch of, um, I don't know what material this is, but I like these ribbons. Um, I'll, I like add them to my embellishments for like, um, like contrast. So I like these a lot. Um, here's some fabrics. Um, I will tear these up and I'll use them in embellishments. Um, I'm pretty sure I've uh, done some videos. I like these colors. Like they'll be good for um, the spring. And um, anyway, I think I've done some videos to show you guys um, how I use my fabrics. Uh, here's a couple bags that it looks like she made these because I have this fabric right here. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure she made these and that's pretty cool because, um, oh, she, oh wow, she lined it. Check that out. Like that's a different fabric. Yeah, see, I envy that because I can't sew. I can sew paper. I can't sew fabric. Um, I can sew fabric to paper, but, but sewing fabric to fabric mm -mm, doesn't turn out very well. So there's that one, and there's this one. This is neat. Oh, pretty. Nope. <laughs> I like these. These are cute. I like little bags like this. I will use them in my organizations. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's pretty. She used a ribbon to tie the ribbon. <laughs> that's cute. Um, here are some, looks like just some scrap pieces, which is what we, um, had agreed upon. So that's cool. Oh, these are different kinds of yarns. Okay. So we've got some eyelash trim in here. You've, this is the eyelash trim right here. Just in case you guys are wondering. Um, this looks like, uh, some more eyelash trim, uh, some fringe, some, this is soft. I like that. Um, it looks like she just kind of wrapped a whole bunch of stuff around this card, which is kind of cool. It'll be fun to unwind. Some color in there too. That's pretty. And it's so soft. Like it's really, really soft, which is cool because um, like most people like soft things. Uh, but I have like this, I guess, extra sensory thing Anyway, it's very soothing and calming to me. It's not like, oh, it's soft. Okay, cool. No, it's like if I have a migraine, I will go and lay down in my bed and my bed is surrounded by like this. You got to love my husband. Okay. Just because he's the one who actually did this for me, but he's got a mink, uh, a Korean mink blanket on the bottom, not a sheet, but the blanket. And then on top of that is another 
like that same feel of material but not as soft on top of that and then I've got two body pillows that are like um like super super I don't even know what they're called like I really don't anyway um I really really love that soft soft feel um and it's even better when I wash it because it stays soft forever anyway um that's not why y'all joined me y'all joined me so um I could show you all my goodies this is pretty I like this I like this this is like uh kind of Christmassy I think I like that some brown Ooh, I like this this is sheer this will go really well with a lot of the Easter stuff that I'm making um oh that's a um a tape measure some flowers I'll have to show you guys some of the uh, embellishments that I'm making um these look like Yes, they are. I don't know what these are called, but they're really cool. Um, they're fabric flowers. So I got some purple, some white, some peach, some black, some purple, some blue. Oh, that's pretty. Some brownish colored. Like it's kind of like coffee colored. Um, and some green turquoise. Those are pretty. Yay. I get to play. Okay. So, um, no, no, stay. And then we've got, oh. These are my favorite. I know they're vintage. <laughs> She's funny. Okay. So. Thanks. Oh, that's nice. I like that. All right. You're going to have to move out the way so I can see. Oh, look at that. Isn't that pretty? Mm. There we go. That's nice. It's a lace. Um... Careful putting the paper clips on the lace for future reference because the paper clips, either you have to break them to get them off or they'll poke holes in your lace. Not that you knew that, but you might have. I don't know. <laughs> um, I normally just put a piece of tape on there. So there's that lace. Isn't that pretty? Um... <laughs> Crud. Oh, wait. I got it. All right. Ah, we on. <laughs> so there's another one. Isn't that pretty? But yeah, if I close them up, like if I'm putting them in Happy Mail or whatever... I'll do this, like a ribbon with a ribbon, or a rubber band, or a piece of too, tape. Um, <laughs> sorry. Um, so then there's this one. You see that coloration on there? I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but that's really cool. That's neat. Oh man, I got some more toys to play with. I mean, laces. Oh, these are two different ones. Oh, how cool is that? It's like, um, actually, I don't know what it is, but it's cool looking. It looks kind of like, kind of like leaves. Yeah, looks kind of like leaves. Let's see if we can put that up there. Some blue. There we go. Y'all see that? That's really cool. Oh man, there's more. Oh, this one is that one. Okay. So this one is that one. Ooh, that's pretty. It's an applique. Pretty. That'll go really nice on a cover of a journal. Very, very, very nice. These are all really pretty. Uh, did I go over all these? Okay, let's move this over here because we went over that. Okay. Some of that 
some stars. Let go. Okay. I didn't want to let go. But you know what? <clears throat> I was thinking about the paperclip thing. That really doesn't bother me too much because I have so many paper clips is unreal like decorated and undecorated like it's it's insane it really is insane um i thought about it because i just like pulled this one apart too because it wasn't cooperating um but like let's see if i have this bag beside me like this bag is full of paper clip bases to make altered paper clips with um, this bag is full of like scrappy embellishments that are paper clipped right now because they need to be sewn. Um, and then I have another container that's like up there in my, on top of my desk, that's like a container of containers. It's also full of paper clips. And I also have a container <laughs> in my desk drawer for like handy. I need them to like mail off or whatever or bills or whatnot. Um, paper clips. This is soft. I'm sitting here like just playing with this. This is so soft. Like I have no idea what material this is, but this is really soft. I like this color too because I don't actually have a lot of like stuff that's like this rich. Um, this is nice. It'll go well with my Easter stuff too. Um... Oh, these will be really cool for like different kinds of accents on embellishments. I have no idea what it is, but it looks cool. Isn't that cool? Like, like it's all, it's shiny, but it's not, and it's pretty flat too, which is weird because you look at it and it doesn't look like it should be flat, uh, but it is. And then the same thing. And I love the fact that you like included all these little ribbons. They're so cute. Um, but this one's the same way, but blue. You see? That's really pretty. I really want to start playing with that. Um, I've been working on making a bunch of embellishments um, for like the journals and such. And that'll be something that I want to play with. Uh, give me just one second. Um, so this one is from Miss Alexandra Medley, and I'm like completely butchering this card. Yeah, um, yeah, there we go. Let's put that back underneath the tape. Uh, like that did not want to come apart at all. Okay, so this one is another one of the swaps. And, ooh, that's cool. Oh, it's a postcard. That's neat. A recipe card. That'll be good because I'm uh, eventually, eventually going to do a, um, a cookbook. Uh, a card, it just has this, the swap name and her username on there. And a notepad with some unicorns or no it's a sheet of paper it's a it comes from a notepad but it's it's one sheet of paper it's pretty though it's really pretty another one do something awesome some alphabet stickers those are really pretty I need to start using alphabet stickers because I get those a lot in these swaps and I don't know what to do with them uh, live and love, plan and execute, to do, to call, and errands. Uh, another postcard. This one's Florida. That's kind of cool because I used to live right, I used to live in Florida, and then I also used to live beside Florida, like way over here. See where it says Pensacola right there? I used to live right beside that. There's a county called Baldwin County, and that's where I used to live. Um, I actually spent the bulk of my childhood there. Um, well, sort of. But anyway, so that was from Miss Alexandria. And uh, lots of cards and notepad uh, papers. So that was cool. 
This one is an Etsy order. This one's from Bonnie and Clive. And I really want to open this without destroying the envelope because when I'm done with this video, I'm going to take these tags back off. I'm going to keep this envelope and I'm going to put it in my journal because it's from Australia. <laughs> like, it's cool. I know I'm really tacky and crazy, but, um, yeah. Uh, I don't know how to open this. Okay, uh, let's see. Maybe this side. Um... All right, we're just gonna cut around the seal here and see if I can't. just in case, you know, y'all wanted to watch me open an envelope. Because sometimes that can be quite hilarious. Um, but yeah, that's the customs form. Um, Miss Bonnie and Clive on Etsy. And oh, how cute. She sent me a little clothespin. Uh, not a clothespin. A safety pin with a, uh, with a butterfly. I love butterflies. You all see that? Isn't that cute? That is cute. And I don't know what this material is, but it's really cool. And I don't want to cut it. Oh, good. I don't have to. Okay. That's neat. Like, I'm not sure what material this is, but this is really neat. Hmm. Might have to play with that. Okay. So, honestly, I forgot what I ordered. Because it's been a minute. Because, uh, as you guys know, international shipping, it takes a while. So, what did I buy? Okay, thank you for your order and your supporting my little Etsy shop. All the very over here in Australia, much appreciated, Bonnie and Clive. Okay, oh, that's what I ordered. Um, these little bags, they are, they're little candy bags and they're coffee dyed. Aren't they cute? Like, that's just adorable. Um, I think there's tin down there. Yes. And then she sent me. See, this is what they look like beforehand. And then this is what they look like after she's done with them. And then I buy them. <laughs> so this is extra stuff, which is really cool. One, I get another bag. Um, oh, it's a little embellishment. Oh, how cool is that? That's, that's neat. She's made this little embellishment. Oh, it's got a little button. That's, that's really neat. I'm going to put that in my embellishment box. Um, a card, a playing card. Uh, actually, I think this is two playing cards put together. That's cool. Ooh, another little bag. That's neat. I have no idea what that is, but it's really cool. I like the bag. Like, I really like the bag. You can put this in the journal um, and add like a long tag. Oh, and there's another one. Oh, you know what these remind me of? Only these don't have gussets, which I actually like better. But you know when you go to the gas station and you can get like a churro or something? They have little bags like this. That's what it reminds me of. This is pretty. I like this. Thank you so much. So that was an Etsy order. Um, and then this one is not. This is from Miss Ro Maloney. And this is... I think this is local, like domestic, I mean, because it's got a forever stamp on it, which, I mean, I could be wrong, 
but I cover up the dates and I don't think about it until afterwards. I really need a letter opener. And I keep saying that. And I never get one. Um, okay. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Ugh, there we go. All right. Look at that washi tape. That's pretty. I'll see that. Isn't that pretty? Um, some tea. Uh, ooh, chai vanilla caramel. Um, yes. Some sticky notes. Also fantastic. I love sticky notes. All right. I hope these little goodies brought some joy to your mailbox. Heck yeah, man. Stay creative, Ro Maloney. Yes, ma'am, it did. Ooh, some Project Life cards. You can also make embellishments out of the Project Life cards. And some stickers. Very cool. They're like, they're like, ah, uh, they're, uh, blah, 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 blah. sorry, I forgot how to talk. They're little puffy stickers. Like, they're, they're puffy. And they're so tiny. You can see how tiny they are? Like, they're as big as my nail. And they're so tiny and cute. Oh my gosh. I love this washi. I'm going to put that with my washi right there. Um, I need to keep a card, though. So, because you have to rate the, when you're done, when you receive your swaps and whatnot and all that hoopla, you have to rate them. Um, that's why I've been putting this stuff back in the envelopes. Um, okay, let's see what else we got. Um... Let's see, it looks like I can go that way. Alright. Alright. Isn't that a cool envelope? It's for St. Patrick's Day. That's neat. Alright, what do we got? This is also the same group. Some notepads, um, pages, notepad pages. <laughs> it's a llama. <laughs> That's funny. Um, uh, four leaf clover, well, three leaf clover. Some clovers here. Some stickers, some strips of stickers. Enjoy the little things. Future is to create it. Weekend and weekend. Yeah, that's nice. I like that. Um, okay, so I'm going to have to put this back in there because she didn't send the, uh, the card card. So I need to, uh, her information's on the back of the envelope. And so this one is from the UK. And we're actually almost done. Seem to be, be, I seem to be getting better at these and not taking an hour to go through my mail. Um, as I say that, I look up and it's a 30 minute, a 30 minute video. Um, this is I think this is an Etsy order, but I'm not sure because this doesn't have a name on it. It just has, I'm going to cover up the, ad, like you can see the UK part right there. And then I'll go back down and cover up the address part. It just says return on there. So I don't know. I don't know if this is an Etsy order or if it's like, I don't know if it's a swap. I mean, that's one heck of a swap, but I want to say this is an Etsy order. Um, the stamps and such, but it's, it's weird though, that there's like nothing in here to indicate what it is. Hmm. I don't know. I will have to go through and look. Anyway, there's a bunch of stamps. 
um, Zimbabwe. Um, let's see. There's all kinds of uh, Polkish. Um, uh, Polska um, from Poland, I assume. Um, Portugal. Kenya. Um, Uganda. Zimbabwe. Uh, that's, that's a U.S. stamp. Uh, another Kenya, New Zealand, uh, another Kenya. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. Anyway, it's just, it's a bunch of stamps and they are used. Uh, I got them. If this is the Etsy order that I'm thinking it is, then I got them for, um, working on embellishments for the journals. But like I said, it's it's weird because there's like there's nothing, no indication, no like hey, this is what this is type of thing. And you know, if I didn't get mail all the time, it'd be one thing. But I get I do get mail all the time because I have this you know crazy obsessive you know habit of shopping and swapping. Like I like stuff in my mailbox, so I do a lot of swaps and. I buy way too much stuff. Uh, this is also from Miss Jill. And like I said, I don't remember what this was because I thought we were done with our slots, or at least maybe. Oh, this is the loaded uh, in pocket. I thought you already did the loaded pocket. Didn't you already do? <laughs> I lose track of what's going on. Okay, so. Um, oh, no, we had two loaded envelopes. That's right, okay. Now that makes sense. All right, I'm back up to par. Look at those, aren't those pretty? These have like a really cool texture on them. I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but it's a really, really cool texture. See, that is really neat. Um, what did you put in here? Oh my gosh. I'm out. I see you. Isn't that cool? I like that pocket. I like this paper. This paper is like really thick. Okay, so this one is 3D Alpha Sticker Pops. Huh, <laughs> that's cool. Uh, notes card. I think this is from the same paper, and you guys, like, you can. Here, how thick that is. That's crazy thick. A tag. You'll have to let me know what paper line this came from because this is some really thick paper. Oh, how cute. It's a little tiny envelope. Hey, open. Look. Hey, ain't it cute? I love it. Oh, that's so cute. Doilies. I love doilies. Doilies are very fun. Um, live, laugh, love. Looks like this is a die cut. I think she cut this out and then put this on the envelope. That's very cool. Oh, that's ingenious. Oh. Did she do that? Or... I, okay. I think I just came up with an idea based on this card. Only because I know that uh, this is a manufactured um, envelope. Um, only because of the glue. That's the only reason that I know that. Um, but <laughs> I just made me think about something. So stay tuned. Um, what lies behind us and what lies before us are tiny matters compared to what lies within us. Ralph Waldo Emerson. That's cute. I like that inspiring another envelope oh and she put double-sided tape on it so you could actually use it oh that's really cool so there's lines here for an address and then you can still put your address and your postage on here and she's got double-sided tape so you can use it for an actual postage envelope I'm gonna put this in my envelope box which is ridiculously full <laughs> but I want to use that. Oh, Journey. Isn't that pretty? Aw, that's 
so sweet. I love it. I love it. Some buttons. I like buttons. Buttons are fun. Uh, my first notebook. Thanks for the idea. You are quite welcome. Um, all right. Wait. Come out of there. And voila. Oh. Voila. Wishing you a wonderful day. Hugs. Jill. Aw. I like this. That's cute. Okay. I see what you did. I'm... It makes sense now. Okay. That's very cute. Haha. <laughs> That's awesome. I like this. I like this paper too. That's nice. Um, where did I go? Okay. Um, okay. I think we went over that stuff. The essence of love is kindness. Aw, I still want to know what this paper is, because this paper is so freaking awesome. Uh, tell your story. This is my life. That's so cute. A little bit of sunshine is what you are to me. Aw, that's so sweet. I like these little sentiments. This is my story and I wouldn't change a thing. I love my life. That is awesome. Can y'all see that? Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Oh, it's a card with an envelope. Okay, more. Uh, this little organizer holds a lot of stuff. Great for crafts, uh, brushes, etc. It is not your, if it is not your thing, keep it for a small gift swap. I have given like six or seven away and everybody loves them. <laughs> okay, no problem. I actually know exactly what this is um, because I have some. <laughs> um, um, and I might actually swap out the basket that's on my desk for this, um, depending. But yes, so that is very cool in indeed indeed it's a wise choice sorry it's a character from a game i play so there's that there's that there's that there's that hey there's that okay okay there's that there's that <laughs> okay okay Throw that over there oh more uh loaded envelope number two so we already went over that. We know that it's loaded envelope number two. And these tags are so cool. Come out. No, nope, I want you out. Because you can alter these. And um, they're like really good size. I like this. And they're different uh, colors. Huh, days of the week. Life number one. I like that one. I like all of these. These are cool. These are nice little additions to um, to Happy Mail, to journals, to whatever. So here's some bows. It looks like she made, which you have a lot more patience than I do because I cannot. If it's more than one cut on a die cut, I don't do it. I got it once. That's it. <laughs> so that's cool. I like these. That's very neat. I like my basket. <laughs> um, signature essentials. Teresa Collins. Create a beautiful life. Interactive flip book. Hmm. Interesting. What are you? Open. No. Open. All right, flip books are the perfect base for creating a custom interactive project, okay? Well, I know what a flip book is, but what in the world? Uh oh, I broke it. 
Uh oh. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. Um. I'm a little lost right now. I'll be honest, I have no idea what this is or how to work it. <laughs> oh, okay, wait a minute. Nope. Um, okay, well there's that. There's that. And that. And that. Okay. Um... And my husband just got home. You'll probably hear him open the door. Okay. I think I figured it out. Uh, I think. Okay. I got it! Hi, baby! Is that for me? I just got something else in the mail. So, good thing we're doing a mail video. Um, okay. Ooh, 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 I figured it out. <laughs> It just needed to be worked a little bit. That's kind of cool, actually. Ha ha! <gasps> I win. Sorry, my son just scared the crap out of me. He was behind me and I didn't know it. All right, so there's that. And let's see. Um, there is this, which is from Miss Courtney. Um, I have no idea how to pronounce your last name, but we're going to put that right there. And, oh, this is cool. She has completely altered this, um, manila envelope. Hey. Okay. Y'all have got to appreciate this. This is amazing. Okay. She painted all of this that is very cool what is this oh you know what this is the um i think this might be the scrapbooking like care pack not the care package but it was like a stuffed envelope um but it was scrapbooking stuff hey stop that Okay, my stuff is not cooperating. Y'all have, uh, y'all gotta see this again. I mean, that is just really cool. And then that's the back. Like, it's a manila envelope that she completely painted and, like, stenciled. Like, I definitely appreciate mixed media because I can't do it personally. So, well, I don't do it personally. Um, here's some washi tapes on a uh, playing card. So that's cool. Um, ooh, pretty. Some paper. Ooh, this is some nice collage paper. Um, I'll be able to use that. I have this paper pad, this one here. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have this one too, but I don't remember. I know I have this one. I just know I've seen these images before. Um, so I'm not entirely sure. Some vellum. Another piece of vellum. That is really neat. Actually, this is not vellum. Neither one of these are vellum. I don't know what I'm talking about. This is acetate. Isn't that pretty? Like, that's really cool. I think I opened this backwards. Um, sweet baby girl. That's what it says on this paper. I don't know if y'all can see that. Um, some circles, shiny paper. So, I don't know what this is called. Uh, the design. Some various pieces of paper. Um, an envelope template. Another envelope template. Another envelope template. Another envelope template. 
And another envelope template. This one's kind of neat. I haven't seen this one. All these other ones I um, have used or have seen, but I haven't seen this one. Uh, that's kind of neat. Some papers here. And oh my gosh, what is that? I so went out of order. But look at that. Or it can just fall on my face. Isn't that cool? Okay, that is really, really neat. Oh, very neat, very neat. Um, very, very neat as an elephant. Isn't that cute? Okay. Um, so we've got a tag here. Uh, Flashcard. A bingo slip. this I'm still trying to figure out what this is um, some old book pages um, looks like it's in German looks like a first aid book it's like a nurses or first aid book that's cool uh, bugs. Some various book pages. Oh, pretty. Is that wallpaper? I think that's wallpaper. Isn't that pretty? Uh, some more book pages. A uh, dictionary page. Uh, music. Music sheets. Uh, some more tags. Various lengths. Um, some more tags here. So we've got this teal colored one. Um, are these? No, they're punch outs. Some smaller ones here. Uh, some blank white ones. A few of those. Um, this is, oop. Yeah, um, okay. So, I'm not sure what this is. Like, I was thinking that there was like a note or something in there. Um, some project life cards. Ugh. Okay. Some project life cards. Um, some stickers. Some heart stickers. Some trim stickers. Those are cool. Um, paper. Ah! A note. Ah! Art journal fodder, yes. Um, okay, cool. Uh, I was thinking that maybe it was like an Etsy order and I was trying to figure out, <laughs> like, when did I buy this? Okay, so, um, so yes, this is another swap and it's just basically anything and everything that can go into an art journal is what that was. Um, Oh, that's cool. Um, so, she said, if you'd like a fun challenge, I challenge you to make one journal page or two page spread. Well, I don't really do page spreads, but I can make embellishments. How about we make a compromise on that? Uh, using only the items in this package. I can do that. That would be fun. Um, yeah, I don't really make spreads so much because I don't scrapbook. Um, but I can definitely make embellishments. Um, here are some, this is really neat. I like this little bag already. That's just various pictures that I did not have to cut out, which is why I love it even more. Like I didn't have to cut any of this out. So that's absolutely fantastic. Um, I don't know where they came from. I don't care where they came from because I didn't have to cut them out. I was reading the words on the bottom there. Um, four color process. Uh, I think they're just magazine clippings, actually. 
but they're really cool. Like I said, even cooler, because I didn't have to cut them out. Sorry, I'm, I'm done now. <laughs> um, some more pictures here. This would be really cool for people who um, do mixed media. Like I said, I don't really do mixed media. I can definitely get my, like, try it out, but that's not my really do too much of. Um, so I'm actually interested to try it out. I have a lot of stuff to play with now. These are cool. And there's that. Okay. So that was that. Um, not actually done with this yet. Uh, da, da, da. Oh, come here. Oh, there's a little tiny envelope. I didn't even see that. Okay. Um, oh, this is cool. These are like, for one, this t envelope is ridiculous. Like, that is tiny. There's little sentiments in here. Like, little stickers. That's, that's really, really, really cool. Okay. I like that a lot. Hey, no, come back. Okay, so. There's that. Okay, I thought this was going to be a short video. I thought I was doing good with getting through everything. And then I looked up and it's like, this is an hour long video. Um, again, but y'all should be used to it by now. <laughs> My videos are starting to get a little ridiculous. Um, here's some different die cuts. Um, so that's cool. Wait, hey, hey, get back. Get back in there. All right, so this one, uh, the next one I'm gonna open off camera because my husband brought it in the door when he walked in the door. Um, so, or not gonna open it off camera, but I'm gonna like, hold on, I'll show you. Cause all the other ones I tape up before I even turn on the camera. I tape them, tape them up so you can't see the address or nothing. And um, this one is gonna be a little bit different because I didn't tape up the address. So, wait, okay. So, this is a very giant envelope. And this is, oh gosh, okay. More stuff. Okay, this is the thing I was looking at before. Okay, so we're gonna go through these fairly quickly because this thing in here I wanna show you guys. Um, so these are just some stickers that I got. Um, a die cut pack, because I mean, you guys know how much I love fussy cutting, so I buy them. Um, more stickers. A lot of the stickers I bought a couple packs. Um, this one is really cool. This one here. Um, this one came out. Well, looks like I'm showing you guys that one anyway. All right. And they're just they're just die cuts. Um, various things like that. Uh, kindness is the sunshine in which friends uh, friendship blossoms. That was cute. And the package opened, which is why these are out. Uh, da, da. Uh, holidays. Some little sequins go over there. Uh, our getaway. That over there. Oh, that goes with that. Okay, let's get through these. And some more stickers. These were all like a dollar or two um, a piece. I think most of these were like 86 cents. I don't know if I'm going through these a little too quickly. So, there's that one. I'm gonna bend over a little bit so I can see the um, camera. 
so my voice may have changed. I'm not sure. Like I said, I did get multiples, so if you guys see one that you've already seen, that's why. Because like I said, these were like 80-something cents a piece. And free shipping, so. Not pretty. I love getting my stickers from there because you get really, really, really pretty stuff and it's very inexpensive. Like, it's basically the same price as going to the Dollar Tree and paying for their stickers, but it's, like, better quality. I mean, it's still imported because Dollar Tree imports their stuff, too. Um, you just got to wait a little while for it to get home. That's all. All right, so this one, uh, this one I think is the same thing as, yeah, that one. And that's what's on the package. Um, here's some pieces that fell out of the other one. Yeah, put that over there. Okay. And then this one here, this one's really cool. This is the other die cut um, collection that I got. And then the last thing I wanted to show you guys, I wanted to get through that really quick because I knew what this was. And this is the first time I've ever bought paper from them. But I was pretty excited when I saw it. Um, so I got two different ones. So I've got this one here. It's paper pad. Um, it doesn't have a style on it, but it has, uh, I was looking for something like anything that had like a paper, uh, like a, a style, but I think this is going to be like, that's it right there. So, uh, this has 24 sheet pad, two sheets of designs, and two die cut sheets. Um, and this was $10. So, and it is a paper pad. Ooh, that's textured. That's cool. Some wood. Look at this paper. Like, <laughs> this is crazy. This is like right up my alley as far as like my aesthetics and such. And then there's the die cuts. Right there. I don't know what the two sheets of designs and two sheets of die cuts is because they, there's a lot of designs on here. So it's more than two. I don't know what they're talking about. But there are two sheets of die cuts, which is cool. So there's that one. And then this one is um, similar, but it's more blue. Um, all right. I think it's cool though, that how they just put a like this cardstock back here. So here's the blue one. If I had the means to make my own paper pad like this, I so would. I don't know how to do it though. <laughs> and then there's the die cuts. Isn't that neat? 10 bucks for these and these are 10 by 10 so they're a little bit smaller than the 12 by 12 obviously bigger than the 8 by 8 but these size of papers would actually be really good for um, like your traveler notebook type journals 
or if you're making junk journals, the size of paper, and you still end up with some left over to make your embellishments. So that's actually it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and close on this video because it is over an hour long and those upload times are crazy. So anyway, hopefully I can get this up for you by this evening. It is Monday afternoon. Um, it's 4.30 for me right now, but, and I'm on the East Coast. So I'm gonna basically close this out and upload it straight into my computer and then try to get it into YouTube, hopefully before midnight, cross your fingers. Um, but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to let me know how the lighting was. If it was any better, did you notice a difference? Um, so, and it, if it was a difference, was it a good difference? Um, so anyway, um, thank you so much for watching and until next time. Bye guys.